Howdy, howdy, folks. It's Donnie here once again. And this time, I just want to do a really quick video in our continuing series about System D basics. And this time, I just want to real quickly show you how to set your daemons up so that if the daemon crashes, it will automatically restart. Now, this is something that's been in Windows for a very long time, and we're just now getting it in Linux with System D. So let's say, for example, we have our Apache web server. And it's running, so it's all good, right? So let's say that our Apache web server crashes. And I'm just going to use kill all in order to simulate it crashing. And, oh, there you go. It's failed. And you can see there, we can do a status as many times as we want to, and it's just not going to come back. So, now let's go ahead in here and we'll go into the Etsy, System D, System, Multi-User Target Wants Directory. And we see in there our HTTPD.Service file. So let's go ahead and edit that. And right down here under service, I'm going to place a line. It says restart equals always. And I will save that. And now let's do sudo systemctl. Daemon reload like so. Okay, like that. I just didn't need that dash in front of it. Sometimes I get confused with the dashes, but <laughs> anyway, uh, so just do the daemon reload without that preceding dash. And now let's go ahead here and look at our Apache again. The status still off. Let's go ahead and start it. Take just a moment. Any day, any day. There we go. And so now it's running. And let's now do our kill all again. And we'll see what happens. So there's a status. Status, again, still off. And it's still off. But you see down there, at the bottom, it says that it's starting the Apache server. So it'll just take a moment. And there we go. There we go. It is now running. So that's all there is to it. So just quick and easy way to set your daemons up so that they will restart upon a crash. So that's all there is to it. If you like the video, be sure to like and be sure to subscribe, and we will see you next time.